All right, what's up everybody? I'm in the garage here. I am turning some drumsticks um, for a guy on YouTube, Buckin' Billy Ray Smith. Um, he's got a cool channel. He's a uh, tree feller. I think that's how you say that. And uh, he's got a lot of drums, uh, vintage drums that he plays and refurbishes, which is cool. Little, um, nothing fancy woodworking there, some sandpaper, some some just uh, simple stuff to that works for him and I, I like that kind of stuff so uh, swing on over check him out if you guys want to um, I'll put the link in the description um, give him give him a um, subscribe if you like what he's doing he's he's kind of a cool guy seems, he seems a little crazy too which is always fun um, especially when you're climbing gosh 40 50 60 70 feet in the air felling trees uh, I, I couldn't do that so um, Buck and Billy Ray Smith hopefully you can see that All right, anyways, um, he requested a hickory ones, so I made two hickories, put little um, one-inch increments and burned those in there, and what I, I went to the local drum, drum store and bought, uh, I think four bucks, five bucks for all these drumsticks to beat up, got a bunch of different tips, um, so that's kind of what I wanted, and I didn't know what, what Billy wanted, so I'm going to make a few different ones. Um, hickory ones, I kind of tried to match this tip with this stick so that's one and then I'm gonna try next uh, I think I'm gonna, yeah in bloodwood I'm gonna make this one out of this bloodwood Let's see if I can get a yeah you see how red that is and I don't know if he'll be able to use these I don't know if they'll be too heavy or, or what but um or he might just like you know hang them up on the wall or whatever so uh, that's it that's what we're gonna do I got you chucked up on the lathe for some bloodwood action um, I'll probably put you back here I don't know that kind of works but it, I got you on my light stand right now and I can't have the light on because it gets too hot and messes with the GoPro so um, plus I'll probably you'll probably yeah be over my shoulder won't be able to see it I'll put you over here and um, I'm just using a roughing gouge and parting tool and just one of my um, modified you know skews I guess you want to call it uh, and some sandpaper nothing fancy pretty straightforward this is what I'm going to try to make out of this one alright here we go left I got um, American Hickory, Quilted Maple, Bloodwood, not sure where that one's from, I can't remember off the top of my head, and then Genuine Mahogany from South America, not the African stuff where it's coming out of now. Um, you can tell Genuine Mahogany in the Medullary Rays there's uh, this white pithing in there. Uh, let's see, it goes all the way up and that's how you can tell how you got 
good genuine mahogany, at least one way. And I'll cut a couple different tips up there for different tones, um, softness, the way acoustic, if you're metal, whatever. So I'm not sure what all those make a difference of, but I did a bunch of different ones. Put a little uh, <clears throat> burning down here at the end, five little rings on each. Uh, let's see. Yeah, go check out Buckin' Billy Ray Smith on YouTube. He's a tree feller, which is crazy. Gets way up in there. And a drummer, obviously. That's why we got these. So stay tuned for more. Go check him out. Give him a subscribe if you like what he's doing. And be safe out there.